Personal Mastery Written and published by Angus Life Personal mastery involves exploring and understanding oneself on a deep level. Taking charge of your life involves managing your emotions, thoughts, and actions to match your core values, beliefs, and goals. Becoming the master of your own destiny is all about taking control of your life, instead of just going along for the ride. Essentially, personal mastery involves developing a deep comprehension of your identity, values, and priorities. It requires uncovering the external factors, societal pressures, and negative beliefs that may have hidden your true self. By engaging in self-exploration, you will discover your strengths, weaknesses, passions, and purpose, enabling you to make informed decisions that align with your authentic self. Personal growth also involves building self-discipline, resilience, and emotional intelligence. You need to effectively handle your thoughts, emotions, and reactions in a positive and empowering way. By understanding your inner self, you will be more prepared to handle the difficulties and intricacies of the outside world with poise, insight, and calmness. Furthermore, personal mastery entails taking control of your life and not allowing circumstances to dictate your outcomes. It involves actively working towards your goals and dreams, while also acknowledging that growth and change are natural aspects of the process. It's all about adopting a mentality of always learning, improving oneself and growing personally, understanding that becoming a master is a journey that lasts a lifetime. In the end, Personal mastery involves leading a life filled with authenticity, integrity, and purpose. It involves respecting your values, establishing boundaries, and creating supportive relationships and environments that encourage your authentic self. Embarking on the journey of personal mastery empowers you to mold your life based on your innermost desires and dreams, leading to a life that is authentically yours, free from external influences. In today's fast-paced world, it's simple to lose sight of our true selves. We face a constant stream of external influences, societal pressures, and the opinions of others that can cause us to doubt our value and question our life choices. Personal mastery is essential for regaining control and living a life that reflects our core values and dreams. This book emphasizes that genuine satisfaction originates from within. It inspires you to liberate yourself from seeking approval from others and conforming to society's standards and instead celebrate your individual talents, values, and dreams. You will discover how to ignore negative opinions and criticism and instead concentrate on developing a positive mindset and a strong connection with your true self. On these pages, you will discover more about yourself, revealing your inner strength, resilience, and potential. You will learn about setting boundaries, communicating assertively, and building healthy relationships that promote personal growth. If you want to conquer self-doubt, escape toxic relationships, or lead a more meaningful life, personal mastery is the perfect tool to help you take charge and shape your own future. Discover the valuable lessons and start a journey towards mastering yourself, finding inner peace, and unlocking your full potential. Lesson 1. Control your own life. Empowering yourself and transforming your life can be a truly rewarding journey. It's all about understanding that you are in control of your own narrative and that the decisions you make influence the path of your life. By taking control, you are asserting your power and choosing not to be a passive observer in your own life. Taking charge of your life starts with developing self-awareness and recognizing your values, strengths, and limitations. It involves recognizing the areas where you might have given up control or let outside factors influence your choices. Understanding what is important to you you can help you refocus your efforts on your true aspirations and objectives. Being in charge of your life involves cultivating self-discipline and owning up to your decisions. 
It requires establishing boundaries, effectively managing your time, and consciously making decisions that align with your long-term goals. By taking responsibility for your actions, you gain the power to shape your desired life instead of being controlled by external factors or societal pressures. Moreover, taking charge of your life requires being open to leaving your comfort zone and welcoming growth and change. It involves overcoming limiting beliefs, facing fears, and breaking self-imposed barriers. By fostering a growth mindset and seizing chances for personal and professional growth, you create opportunities for enriching your life journey with new experiences and possibilities. It's important to note that taking charge of your life doesn't involve trying to micromanage every detail of your life or the behavior of others. It's important to understand the limits of your influence and concentrate on what you can control. It's about acknowledging that some events and situations are out of your control, but you can still decide how to react and adjust accordingly. Having self-control is crucial for personal growth and achieving success in various aspects of life. This involves controlling our thoughts, emotions, impulses, and behaviors to achieve long-term goals and values. Learning to control ourselves helps us resist short-term temptations and concentrate on our priorities. Self-control essentially involves a struggle between our current wants and our long-term goals. It takes a lot of mental strength to resist the temptation of instant gratification and distractions that could steer us off, of course. Exercising self-control helps us develop the discipline needed to overcome challenges, avoid procrastination, and make decisions that benefit us. Improving self-control requires consistent practice in training our minds and enhancing our willpower. It involves making a conscious decision to respond instead of react, pausing before acting impulsively, and practicing mindfulness in our everyday routines. This allows us to have better control over our thoughts, emotions, and actions, helping us to handle life's challenges with clear thinking and calmness. Mastering self-control goes beyond just holding back. It also means directing our energy and attention towards meaningful and rewarding activities. Mastering self-control allows us to effectively manage our time, prioritize tasks, and stay committed to our goals, even when faced with obstacles or distractions. Moreover, self-discipline is essential for sustaining healthy habits and lifestyle decisions. It helps us make choices that promote our physical and mental health, like working out, eating well, and taking care of ourselves. Through maintaining discipline in these areas, we develop a strong sense of personal responsibility and accountability that influences every part of our lives. Lesson 2. Do not let others put you down. In a society that frequently prioritizes fitting in and seeking approval from others, it's important to develop the skill of overcoming negativity and holding on to a solid self-esteem. Letting people criticize you can slowly erode your confidence, lower your self-worth, and stop you from living a genuine and satisfying life. To avoid being belittled by others, start by truly grasping and embracing your own value. You possess distinctive talents, perspectives, and experiences that set you apart. Embrace your unique qualities, celebrate your skills, and believe in yourself, no matter what others think or say. It's important to understand that people who try to belittle you may be acting based on their own insecurities, biases, or narrow viewpoints. People's judgments and criticisms reflect their inner struggles, not your true worth. Understanding this allows you to separate their negativity from your sense of self. Avoiding internalizing or validating their harmful narratives. Being around people who support and uplift you can help strengthen your ability to resist negativity from others. Look for connections with people who truly value and appreciate you for being yourself, allowing their encouragement and positivity to overpower any feelings of doubt or negativity. Moreover, practice assertive communication and setting boundaries. When dealing with criticism or attempts to devalue you, 
confidently and clearly communicate your thoughts and needs. Set clear boundaries to safeguard your emotional health and avoid interacting with harmful behavior or unproductive negativity. In the constantly changing world of personal growth and self-discovery, one key truth remains. You shouldn't worry about what others think of you. This realization can free you from seeking external approval and help you live according to your own values, beliefs, and goals. goals. Many times, we get caught up in what others think, letting their views influence how we see ourselves and what we do. We desire approval, search for validation, and twist ourselves to conform to society's perceived expectations. Yet, following this route results in living an inauthentic life where we give up our true selves to meet the expectations of others. It's important to remember that the opinions of others are shaped by their own unique experiences and perspectives. These are not set in stone facts and should not impact how you see yourself. Realizing that other people's opinions are not your concern can liberate you from the need for approval and the worry of criticism. When you stop trying to please others or meet their expectations, you create opportunities for yourself. You find the courage to explore your passions, embrace your uniqueness, and make choices that align with your deepest desires and values, free from external judgment. Moreover, disconnecting from the opinions of others helps foster inner peace and self-acceptance. You no longer feel the need to explain your decisions or seek validation as you firmly believe in your intrinsic worth that doesn't rely on others' approval. This newfound freedom enables you to develop healthier relationships founded on mutual respect, understanding, and appreciation for each other's uniqueness. You can interact with others without worrying about being judged, which helps create stronger connections and more meaningful interactions. Lesson 3. Go deep into your heart. Having a clear vision is essential in our quest for personal growth and self-actualization. Yet, real clarity cannot be achieved just by relying on external sources or logical thinking. Exploring the depths of our hearts reveals our true desires, passions, and purposes that drive our life visions. The heart is commonly seen as where our emotions, intuition, and deepest desires reside. This source of wisdom goes beyond the boundaries of the analytical mind. Learning to silence our thoughts and listen to our hearts allows us to access deep insights and clarity. Developing a habit of self-reflection and introspection is crucial for tapping into this inner wisdom. It's about setting up special spaces for peace and quiet so we can listen to our inner desires and purpose. By meditating, journaling, or spending time alone, we can connect with our true selves. Exploring our inner selves can reveal hidden truths, buried passions or long-forgotten dreams that may have been overshadowed by the busyness of everyday life. These insights can act as guiding lights, showing us the way to align our lives with our core values and dreams. Moreover, by connecting with the clarity that comes from our hearts, we develop a strong sense of unwavering belief and direction, We now make decisions based on our true visions and goals rather than being influenced by external factors or societal pressures. This clear understanding also helps cultivate a feeling of peace and satisfaction as we connect with the rhythms and desires that deeply resonate with us. We develop the bravery to make daring decisions, welcome change, and boldly chase after the dreams that ignite our spirits. Lesson 4. Rejection leads to something even better. Rejection is a natural part of life, and being denied an opportunity you really wanted can be quite disheartening. Rejection can be tough to handle, whether it's from a job, project, or personal endeavor. It can make us doubt ourselves and our abilities. It's important to keep in mind that every rejection we face doesn't define our abilities or potential. Instead, It guides us towards opportunities more aligned with our development and satisfaction. Being turned down can be a powerful force for change, encouraging us to discover different options, build strength, and guide us towards opportunities that truly resonate with who we are. 
Dealing with rejection can lead to a mix of emotions, such as disappointment, frustration, self-doubt, and anger. It is crucial to fully process these emotions as part of the healing journey. It's important to avoid dwelling in negativity or giving in to a scarcity mindset that makes us believe that rejection is the end. Instead, it's important to adopt a growth mindset and see rejection as a temporary obstacle, not a permanent barrier. By changing how we see things, we can focus on looking at ourselves, finding ways to improve, and getting better at what we do for the future. Improving ourselves not only prepares us for future opportunities, but also boosts our self-awareness and confidence. Furthermore, being turned down can be a strong prompt to review our priorities and make sure our goals are in line with what truly matters to us. It makes us question if the opportunity we were pursuing really aligned with our true selves, or if we were pursuing it due to external pressures or societal expectations. Reflecting on our thoughts and feelings can help us uncover new opportunities that resonate with our goals and bring us more satisfaction. Rejection from one opportunity is not a defeat, but a stepping stone toward something better. This is an opportunity to build resilience, explore self-discovery, and welcome the endless possibilities that come with seeing rejection as a way to grow and change. By staying positive and dedicated to personal growth, we can gracefully handle life's rejections, understanding that each no gets us closer to the life-changing. Yes. When navigating human relationships, it's typical to come across qualities or behaviors in others that may be bothersome, from a co-worker's habit of dominating conversations to a friend's constant lateness. Seemingly harmless traits can trigger strong reactions like annoyance, frustration, or even contempt. Yet, these instances of unease offer a chance for introspection and development. When we analyze what irritates us about others, we can gain valuable insights into our own values, insecurities, and opportunities for personal growth. This reflective journey helps us enhance our self-awareness and develop a more compassionate and empathetic perspective towards ourselves and others. When we feel bothered by someone's actions or qualities, it's usually because they are touching on something deep within us, an unresolved issue a hidden insecurity, or a strongly held belief. For example, if a coworker often delays tasks and it bothers us, it could indicate our own challenges with managing time or our need for control. By examining these emotional reactions with curiosity and honesty, we can uncover valuable insights into our own patterns, fears, and opportunities for personal development. Moreover, what concerns us about others can reveal our personal values and priorities. If a friend's focus on material possessions or disregard for the environment resonates with us, it could be a reflection of our own strong beliefs about sustainability or minimalism. These moments are a chance to clarify and strengthen our value systems, helping us to be more authentic and true to ourselves. Participating in this self-reflection process helps develop empathy and understanding. Understanding that our responses to others are often influenced by our own past and viewpoints can help us become less critical and more willing to consider different viewpoints. This change in perspective encourages the development of healthier relationships founded on a shared appreciation and respect for each other's unique qualities. Lesson 5 Exploring Our Inner Selves Exploring our inner selves involves delving deep into our psyche to uncover the complex web of thoughts, emotions, beliefs, and experiences that influence how we see the world. Embarking on this journey involves being vulnerable, honest, and ready to face hidden aspects of ourselves that we may have ignored. Through this introspective journey, we start to let go of the facades we've put on and the personas we've assumed, freeing ourselves from societal expectations and seeking approval from others. We focus on strengthening our bond with our values, purpose, and individual talents to live more authentically 
with integrity and fulfillment. Furthermore, delving into our inner selves is an ongoing journey that continues as we develop and change, leading to deeper understanding of our psyche. Every experience, challenge, and triumph contributes to our internal growth, encouraging us to increase our self-awareness and accept the ongoing evolution of our existence. Exploring our inner selves is a profound journey that helps us unlock the keys to living a purposeful and meaningful life. It is a brave act of self-care, a sign of our dedication to personal development, and an acknowledgement that the most exciting journey is found within ourselves. In a world where there is pressure to conform, silence our voices and doubt our worth, it takes great courage to embrace our authentic selves without apology. Being authentic, sharing your opinions confidently, and building strong self-assurance is a key to personal satisfaction and a way to show self-care and self-esteem. This philosophy is centered on embracing and acknowledging our individual identities, values, and perspectives. We are all unique people made up of our experiences, beliefs, and strengths. It's important to celebrate and express our true selves without holding back. By suppressing these important parts of ourselves, we prevent the world from experiencing our true selves and miss out on living life to the fullest. Communicating our ideas and values clearly and confidently is a powerful form of self-expression and empowerment. We can share our individual perspectives in discussions that influence our communities, question current stories, and encourage others to be true to themselves by bravely expressing our viewpoints. We not only uphold our truth, but also encourage open dialogue, mutual understanding, and respect for different perspectives. Central to this dedication to being genuine is the development of strong self-assurance. Confidence is like a muscle that needs regular exercise and care, not a fixed characteristic. It stems from a strong belief in our intrinsic value, an acknowledgement of our abilities, and a readiness to accept our weaknesses and imperfections as essential aspects of our path. Having confidence in ourselves makes us strong in handling criticism and setbacks. Knowing our worth is not dependent on others' approval or societal standards. This confidence allows us to take risks, follow our passions with determination, and handle life's challenges with grace and resilience with grace and resilience. Lesson 6. Pursuing Our Greatest Goals Exploring oneself involves looking inward and uncovering the layers of societal norms, external influences, and self-imposed restrictions that may have hidden our true identity. We must face our fears, challenge our beliefs, and courageously explore our innermost thoughts and emotions to discover the core principles that shape our lives. As we embark on this significant journey, we may discover buried passions, forgotten dreams, or strong convictions that have been overshadowed by daily responsibilities. These insights shine brightly, showing us the way to follow our true passions and live in accordance with our most important beliefs. Once the guiding principles and aspirations are identified, we can fully dedicate ourselves to pursuing them. Committing to this goal demands unwavering focus, relentless determination, and a readiness to make sacrifices and overcome obstacles that may come your way. We need to be intentional every day, ensuring our actions match our goals and developing the discipline and resilience to overcome challenges and stay focused on our vision. This commitment is not overwhelming, but a deep expression of self-care and personal growth. By dedicating ourselves to chasing our biggest aspirations, we show respect for our true selves and the special talents we bring to the world. We shape our own futures, creating lives filled with purpose, meaning, and personal fulfillment that go beyond temporary joys or outside approval. In a world where external achievements and material success are often valued, True mastery can be found through self-knowledge and self-discipline. 
Understanding how to control our thoughts, emotions, and actions with wisdom and intentionality is the ultimate achievement. It is through this internal mastery that we can unlock our full potential and lead purposeful, authentic, and peaceful lives. Embarking on the path to self-mastery starts with a strong dedication to understanding oneself and exploring one's inner world. It involves being ready to face our inner worlds, to analyze the beliefs, patterns, and conditioning that have influenced our thoughts and actions. By reflecting on ourselves, we uncover important information about our strengths, weaknesses, and motivations. This helps us make decisions that are in line with our core values and goals. Improving oneself also involves developing emotional intelligence and self-regulation. It's all about learning to observe and control our emotional reactions instead of letting them control us. By practicing mindfulness and emotional self-control techniques, we can better handle life's challenges, bounce back from adversity, and approach opportunities with clarity and focus. Moreover, mastering oneself also involves discipline and willpower. One must be able to resist temptation, delay gratification, and persist through obstacles to achieve long-term goals. Through self-discipline, we can conquer procrastination, change habits, and consistently progress in our personal and professional lives. Most importantly, mastering oneself involves embracing self-acceptance and self-love. It's about accepting our flaws and imperfections with kindness while also dedicating ourselves to ongoing self-improvement. Embracing self-acceptance frees us from self-criticism and seeking external validation, allowing us to live authentically and appreciate our individual gifts and perspectives. Lesson 7. Becoming Your Strongest Supporter Inside each of us, there is a constant conversation happening, a mix of thoughts and feelings that influence how we see the world and what we do. For a lot of people, the inner voice can turn into a harsh critic, causing self-doubt and hindering personal growth. Yet, the key to achieving lasting fulfillment and success is by changing our inner dialogue from being our biggest critic to becoming our greatest ally. Starting the journey involves developing self-awareness, which involves taking a moment to observe and listen to the stories in our minds. By illuminating these internal dialogues, we can recognize the negative self-talk, limiting beliefs, and self-sabotaging behaviors that have hindered us from achieving our utmost potential. Maybe we have deep insecurities from past experiences, or we feel burdened by societal expectations that have affected our self-esteem. Identifying these internal obstacles is the initial step towards regaining our power and reshaping our inner scripts, regardless of where they originate. Once we understand the stories that have shaped our lives, we need to actively work on questioning and changing these stories. Counter negative self-talk by practicing self-love, self-acceptance, and self-belief. We need to challenge our limiting beliefs and adopt empowering perspectives that resonate with our true values and goals. Through regularly practicing cognitive restructuring, we can change our neural pathways, forming new thought patterns that enhance our development and overall health. In addition to this mental shift, it's important to develop habits of taking care of ourselves and being kind to ourselves. Many times, we tend to be overly critical of ourselves, more so than we would be towards our loved ones. Embracing our flaws and imperfections with kindness and understanding helps us create a safe emotional space within ourselves. This sanctuary allows us to heal, grow, and nurture our authentic selves without worrying about judgment or condemnation. As we continue on this path of self-improvement, our internal conversations change from being critical to being supportive and encouraging. We learn from our mistakes, celebrate our achievements, and strive to continually improve ourselves both personally and professionally this inner champion serves as a reminder of our intrinsic value, our special talents, and our capacity to conquer any challenge we face. Furthermore, by taking on the role of our biggest supporter, 
we develop a deep sense of trust and reliance in ourselves. We have found the ultimate source of strength and motivation within ourselves, no longer needing external validation or approval. This deep reservoir of self-confidence serves as our beacon, driving us forward with strong resolve and strength even when challenges or obstacles arise. Lesson 8. Ability to Master Themselves In our constant quest for success and accomplishment, we frequently seek external validation, recognition, and material possessions to measure our value. Yet, the real indicator of a person's greatness is not found in outward signs of success, but in their mastery of self, the capacity to control their thoughts, emotions, and behaviors with wisdom, purpose, and genuineness. On the other hand, failure is not determined by a shortage of worldly achievements, but by how much we stray from our authentic selves, giving in to external pressures and societal norms. Mastering oneself involves embarking on a journey of self-discovery, continuously delving into our inner selves to gain a thorough grasp of our values, strengths, and limitations. Confronting fears, questioning assumptions, and examining beliefs and patterns takes courage. By engaging in this reflective process, we uncover valuable insights into our true essence, enabling us to make informed decisions that resonate with who we are and drive us towards advancement in both our personal and professional lives. People who choose to pursue self-mastery enhance their emotional intelligence and self-regulation skills. They can control and handle their emotional reactions instead of being overwhelmed by impulses and reactions. Their emotional strength allows them to handle life's challenges calmly, bounce back from setbacks, and pursue opportunities with a clear and determined mindset, regardless of the obstacles they encounter. Moreover, mastering oneself also involves discipline and willpower. People who have achieved self-mastery demonstrate a strong dedication to their goals and dreams, showing the ability to wait for rewards, avoid distractions, and overcome challenges. Through self-discipline, they consistently take actions that drive personal and professional growth, surpassing the limitations of procrastination and limiting habits. On the other hand, failure does not stem from external factors, lack of talent or resources, but from losing touch with one's true self. When we give in to societal expectations, external pressures, and limiting beliefs, we move away from our true selves, compromising our values, suppressing our desires, and denying our worth. Abandoning oneself can create a feeling of disconnection between our actions and deepest desires, resulting in a purposeless, unfulfilling life. People who neglect themselves may become stuck in patterns of self-sabotage fueled by negative inner dialogue, self-distrust, and a shortage of self-kindness. They often hinder their own progress by being overly critical of themselves and holding on to limiting beliefs. This internal dialogue can hinder personal and professional progress and also affect self-esteem and self-worth, leading to a cycle of self-abandonment and disappointment. Real success is not about accumulating wealth, fame, or status, but about understanding oneself, accepting oneself, and mastering oneself. It's about fully embracing who we are, living according to our values, and consistently pursuing our deepest desires and goals. On the other hand, failure occurs when we stray from our true selves to seek approval from others or meet societal standards. Achieving mastery requires unwavering dedication, relentless pursuit, and an unyielding commitment to one's chosen path. In this realm, talent and natural inclination are just the beginning. True greatness is achieved through a lifetime of dedication, sacrifice, and a strong desire for personal growth. Identifying a cause that deeply resonates with you is essential to becoming a true master. This cause goes beyond temporary interests or casual pursuits. It becomes a powerful force that influences every part of one's life, helping make decisions, driving ambitions, and acting as a steadfast guide through the challenges and obstacles that come up. 
With a strong commitment to their cause, they embark on the path to mastery by tirelessly seeking knowledge and acquiring new skills. It requires a strong desire for learning, a readiness to accept discomfort and a dedication to surpassing self-imposed limits. Those who have mastered their craft know that staying content hinders progress. They see each day as a chance to enhance their skills and knowledge. Striving for excellence is a continuous challenge that involves overcoming personal limitations, self-doubt, and inner critics. Believing in your ability to overcome obstacles, staying resilient through setbacks and failures, and committing to persevere through challenges are essential on the path to mastery. Experienced people see challenges as chances to grow, using each obstacle to reflect, adapt, and improve their skills and strategies. Dedication requires deep self-awareness and self-discipline. Those who excel know the value of building a solid mental and emotional base. This strength helps them stay focused, handle stress, and move through challenges with resolute determination and calmness. In addition, achieving mastery requires being willing to make sacrifices and give up temporary pleasures and distractions in order to pursue a greater purpose. It's important to prioritize your craft, dedicate many hours to improving skills, refining techniques, and pushing boundaries in your chosen field. True masters know that achieving greatness requires sacrifices in other areas of life and full commitment. Lesson 9. Being calm is a source of strength. Being able to manage our thoughts, emotions, and actions with purpose and discipline is a sign of strong inner strength. It reflects a mind that has been developed through self-awareness, emotional intelligence, and a strong grasp of our values and priorities. People who have self-control do not act on impulse or whim. Instead, they make choices that are in line with their long-term goals and aspirations. This inner strength shines through during challenging times or when faced with temptations. As our emotions try to take over, our impulses lead us towards instant rewards. In these moments, self-control acts as a shield, protecting against reactive and impulsive behavior. People who have honed this virtue can stop, analyze their thoughts and emotions objectively, and react with wisdom and clarity instead of giving in to momentary impulses. Self-control and calmness are closely connected, providing us with strength to navigate life's challenges with grace. In a world where chaos, urgency, and constant stimulation are often valued, having inner stillness is a rare and powerful asset. People who are calm are not easily influenced by outside events or others' emotions. They stay grounded in the present moment and are able to handle situations with a clear and focused mind. Being calm goes beyond just being free from stress or agitation. It stems from a profound sense of inner peace and self-confidence. Developing this quality involves being mindful, reflecting on oneself, and staying true to personal values and principles. People who are calm exude a strong sense of stability, capable of navigating through difficult situations with composure and determination. This inner strength, rooted in self-discipline and tranquility, has significant impacts on both our personal and professional lives. When making decisions, it's important to approach challenges with a clear and rational mindset. This involves weighing options objectively and making choices based on reason and foresight rather than emotions or impulsiveness. In our relationships, it promotes emotional growth and understanding, enabling us to communicate well handle conflicts positively, and establish connections based on mutual respect. In addition, having self-control and remaining calm are powerful tools for building resilience, helping us handle life's challenges with poise and composure. People with these traits can overcome challenges by maintaining a positive outlook and seeing obstacles as chances for personal growth. Lesson 10. Take Full Responsibility Throughout life, we all face challenging moments when financial burdens or feeling stuck in uncontrollable circumstances can be overwhelming. 
During these challenging times, it's important to take a moment to acknowledge the significant effort and perseverance that has brought us to this point. We have reached this point through numerous sacrifices, hard-earned victories, and unwavering resilience that helped us overcome many challenges. Amidst the challenges we face, it's crucial to recognize that our circumstances are connected to the energy we put out into the world. This idea is based on fundamental principles of energy and manifestation, emphasizing how our thoughts, beliefs, and emotions shape our realities. When faced with financial challenges or feeling stuck due to external circumstances, it may be a result of the energy we have unknowingly been nurturing. Maybe we have started to believe in limitations regarding our value or ability to achieve abundance. Perhaps fear, doubt, or negative self-talk have influenced our thoughts, creating a sense of scarcity and limitation in our minds. Recognizing this reality, although it may be uncomfortable, is a significant initial move towards freedom. It changes the story from being a victim to being empowered, showing that we have the natural power to influence our reality by the energy we decide to carry. When we fully own the energies we put out, we take charge and unlock endless opportunities by matching our thoughts, emotions, and actions with abundance, freedom, and limitless potential. Aligning our vibrations starts with thoroughly exploring our inner landscape. We need to bravely address the beliefs that are holding us back, along with negative thoughts and emotional blockages. Exploring our inner selves may uncover underlying insecurities, fears, or traumas that impact us without us realizing, leading to ongoing challenges. With self-awareness, we can intentionally create positive energy by practicing mindfulness, affirmations, and nurturing, empowering beliefs and emotions. We can opt to welcome thoughts of abundance, gratitude, and possibility, letting these vibrations fill us and spread outward, drawing in opportunities and circumstances that match our greatest aspirations. Furthermore, we need to be ready to take inspired action by aligning our behaviors and choices with the vibrations we aim to embody. It might require making tough choices, stepping beyond our comfort zones, or embracing new directions that push us past our limiting beliefs and help us grow and evolve. During this journey of change, it's important to maintain a mindset of patience, self-compassion, and strong faith. Changing our vibrations takes time and requires consistent effort to match our thoughts, emotions, and actions with our desired outcomes. Setbacks, moments of doubt, or temporary lapses into old patterns may arise, but staying committed to cultivating positive vibrations can help us navigate these challenges with grace and resilience. In recognizing the deep connection between our circumstances and our vibrations, we gain access to a life filled with abundance, freedom, and endless possibilities. We transition from being at the mercy of our situations to shaping our own future, working together to create our own realities by the energy we put out into the world. Embark on a journey of self-discovery and personal empowerment, recognizing the potential for transformation within us to manifest our dreams and aspirations. Lesson 11. Your Measurable Achievements Learning to control oneself also involves cultivating self-discipline, which allows us to manage our thoughts, emotions, and impulses with intention and purpose. Being able to resist temptation, delay gratification, and persist through obstacles to achieve long-term goals is crucial. People who have achieved self-mastery demonstrate a strong dedication to personal development, consistently taking steps to enhance themselves and reach their full potential. Moreover, achieving self-mastery requires developing emotional intelligence and self-regulation. It requires becoming more aware of our emotions, observing and controlling our reactions to outside influences, and facing life's difficulties with calmness and mindfulness. People who have gained control over themselves are not controlled by their emotions. Instead, they can guide and use their emotional energy in positive and empowering ways. Mastering oneself is a powerful demonstration of self-love and self-acceptance. 
We acknowledge that our value does not depend on outside approval or societal norms, but is instead a fundamental and indisputable truth that exists at the essence of who we are. Embracing our true selves, imperfections included, helps us develop self-compassion and self-respect, freeing us from self-criticism and self-doubt. Mastering oneself is a lifelong journey filled with growth, reflection, and transformation. As we grow and face new obstacles, our self-awareness and self-discipline improve. It's a journey that requires strong dedication, perseverance, and a readiness to welcome challenges and unknowns, as real progress usually happens outside our comfort zones. Mastering oneself is considered the ultimate human achievement as it serves as the basis for all other successes and accomplishments. Once we have control over our inner selves, we can shape our futures and handle any outside obstacles with wisdom, strength, and a clear sense of direction. This journey helps us discover our fullest potential, making a positive impact on the world and bringing inner peace, fulfillment, and self-actualization. Striving for self-mastery is the ultimate goal of personal achievement. However, lacking self-control and losing touch with one's true self can hinder personal growth. On one hand, self-mastery involves discipline, self-awareness, and self-acceptance. On the other hand, lacking these qualities can lead to personal failure, disconnection, reactivity, and unfulfillment. Not being able to control oneself is usually the initial sign of moving away from self-mastery. It shows up as difficulty controlling one's thoughts, emotions, and impulses, leading to a life driven by reacting impulsively and seeking immediate satisfaction. People who struggle with self-discipline can be influenced by outside factors, giving in to desires that offer short-term satisfaction, but hinder their future plans. Lack of self-discipline can affect different areas of life, leading to issues like procrastination, poor time management, unhealthy coping mechanisms, and addictive behaviors. This cycle leads to self-sabotage, where short-term indulgences and lack of follow, through create a feeling of stagnation and unfulfillment, which then diminishes self-confidence and motivation for personal growth. Abandoning one's true self is closely linked to a lack of self-control. This results in a slow separation from one's fundamental values, beliefs, and self-worth, as outside pressures and societal norms become more important than personal truth and self-love. People who lose touch with themselves may end up adopting roles and identities that don't match who they truly are, pushing aside their genuine desires and dreams to seek approval or success from others. Abandoning oneself can lead to significant psychological effects, causing feelings of dissonance, emptiness, and a lack of purpose. Without a clear connection to their inner compass, people might feel lost, chasing after goals and lifestyles that don't align with their true desires, resulting in a deep sense of dissatisfaction. Furthermore, when people abandon themselves, it can lead to engaging in self-destructive actions and having critical inner dialogue. People who have lost touch with their true selves might end up sabotaging themselves by being overly critical and engaging in harmful behaviors. This pattern of self-abandonment and self-loathing can create a negative cycle pushing people further away from self-improvement and personal development. It's crucial to understand that personal failure is not a permanent condition, but rather a temporary setback on the journey of self-improvement. People can reclaim their power, reconnect with their authentic selves, and chart a new course toward self-mastery and the realization of their fullest potential by cultivating self-awareness, embracing self-compassion, and committing to the lifelong pursuit of personal growth. Lesson 12. Focus on self-improvement. When it comes to personal development and self-improvement, a key lesson is to focus on looking within ourselves and working on bettering ourselves instead of always criticizing others. 
Many times we get stuck in a pattern of projecting our insecurities, flaws, and shortcomings onto others, which results in blaming, resentment, and lack of progress. Improving oneself starts with understanding that real transformation and progress come from within. Recognizing that we can only change ourselves is a powerful act of self responsibility. Looking within ourselves allows us to discover more about our thoughts, beliefs, and patterns that influence our experiences and perceptions. Engaging in this reflective process involves being open to addressing our areas of unawareness and shedding light on where we might have been acting automatically or holding on to restrictive beliefs. We need to focus on becoming more self aware by observing our thoughts, emotions, and behaviors without judgment and with curiosity. We can only gain the necessary insights to identify the areas requiring growth and transformation through deep self inquiry. Furthermore, achieving self mastery requires dedicating oneself to constantly improving and striving for personal growth and self actualization. Instead of focusing on the perceived flaws or shortcomings of others, we shift our focus to our own growth, welcoming challenges as chances for personal growth and improvement. To shift our focus, we need to change our mindset from being critical and judgmental to one that is centered on self compassion and self acceptance. Instead of being hard on ourselves for our flaws, We embrace our journey of growth with compassion and a mindset focused on progress, understanding that every mistake or obstacle is an opportunity to gain knowledge, adjust, and develop. As we explore this process of self mastery further, we realize that the traits or behaviors we criticize in others often mirror our own inner challenges or unresolved issues. By focusing on ourselves and working on these aspects, We can not only help ourselves grow, but also develop more empathy and understanding for others. Realizing that blaming others or ourselves does not serve a constructive purpose is crucial for personal growth and self mastery. Attributing blame reflects a victim mindset, which undermines our empowerment and hinders us from fully owning our lives and decisions. Embarking on the path to self mastery, Typically starts with taking responsibility for our actions and acknowledging that we shape our own destinies through our thoughts, beliefs, and behaviors. Realizing this can sometimes cause us to blame ourselves, criticize ourselves harshly, and dwell on past mistakes or perceived failures. Self reflection and honest self assessment are important for personal growth. However, focusing on self blame can lead to negativity and self judgment, which can hold us back. It ties us to past events, making us focus on regrets and emotions that sap our energy and hinder our ability to make positive changes. Furthermore, pointing fingers at others is a pointless activity that only strengthens the sense of being a victim and weakens us. Blaming others for our situation means giving up our control and responsibility, creating a cycle of feeling powerless and controlled by external factors. Mastering ourselves requires us to recognize that external forces can impact us, but our decisions, attitudes, and how we handle obstacles ultimately define our reality. Rising above blame doesn't equate to ignoring responsibility or evading challenging self examination. Instead, it requires embracing a growth mindset, viewing challenges and setbacks as chances for learning and personal growth without blaming or criticizing. We recognize our part in shaping our situations, not to blame ourselves, but to be aware and dedicated to choosing differently in the future. Avoiding blame. Whether directed at ourselves or others, is a powerful expression of self love and empowerment. It releases us from feelings of guilt, resentment, and self criticism, allowing us to focus on personal growth, transformation, and achieving our goals. Embarking on the journey of self mastery involves developing inner peace, self acceptance, and recognizing that growth comes from embracing experiences for self discovery and self transcendence.
rather than blaming others. Lesson 13. Make the most of it now. Life is short and fleeting in the grand scheme of things. However, in this fleeting journey, there is a chance for significant growth, satisfaction, and the establishment of a legacy that extends beyond our time on Earth. It's a reminder to fully embrace the present moment, cherish each day, and pursue our dreams with determination. Many times we get caught up in thinking we have endless time, wasting valuable moments on unimportant things, delaying important tasks, and chasing temporary joys. We often reassure ourselves that there will be more opportunities in the future to pursue our aspirations, repair strained connections, and explore the adventures that call out to us. However, the truth remains that our time on this planet is limited, and every moment that goes by is a valuable asset that we can never get back. Recognizing the shortness of life doesn't mean living in fear or anxiety, but instead prompts us to act with purpose and urgency. Remember to focus on what is important. Relationships, passions, personal growth, and making a positive impact on the world. Furthermore, understanding the value of time motivates us to live more authentically and intentionally. We pay closer attention to the relationships we form, looking for connections that feed our souls and enhance our lives. We tackle our work and goals with a fresh enthusiasm and clear direction, knowing the importance of making a significant impact within the limits of our time. Amidst the chaos of today's world, our minds are frequently overwhelmed by various concerns and fears. We worry about things we can't control, dwell on past errors, and imagine our fears in the future. Amidst mental chaos, a profound realization surfaces. If something won't go with us to the grave or is beyond our control, it's a burden we can let go of. This insight encourages us to be selective in where we direct our energy and attention, emphasizing the importance of focusing on what truly matters in life. When we let go of constant worry about temporary issues, we experience a deep sense of freedom and peace. Our focus on possessions, Status symbols and material trappings will become insignificant when we leave this world. They are fleeting distractions with no enduring significance in the bigger picture of our lives. Understanding the temporary nature of things can help us let go of attachment and the need for external validation. Just like that, the thoughts and evaluations of others might hurt temporarily, but they don't define our real value and capabilities. Recognizing that people's perceptions are influenced by their biases, insecurities, and limited viewpoints, allows us to prioritize self-acceptance and authenticity over seeking external validation. Moreover, some aspects of life are simply beyond our control, no matter how hard we try to influence them. We have no control over natural disasters, global events, and the actions of others. Recognizing this reality allows us to free ourselves from the pointless quest for control and concentrate on developing resilience, adaptability, and a profound inner peace. When we adopt this philosophy of releasing, a significant change takes place within us. We learn to appreciate each moment as a valuable present, enjoying the now rather than focusing on the past or worrying about what's to come. Our relationships grow stronger, when we approach our connections with gratitude and presence, instead of letting worries create barriers between us and our loved ones. Furthermore, when we let go of unnecessary worries, we make room for personal development, creativity, and following our true passions. We have moved past anxiety and fear and are now motivated to discover new opportunities, take thoughtful chances, and reach our full potential. Lesson 14 your attention is valuable. In today's fast-paced world, we are constantly surrounded by a flood of information, stimuli, and distractions competing for our focus. Our minds are constantly bombarded by social media notifications and advertising, pulling our focus in different directions. Yet, in the midst of this chaotic environment, a clear truth stands out. Our attention is valuable and limited, 
and how we decide to use it can greatly affect our happiness, efficiency, and overall satisfaction. We should be selective about the company we keep and the environments we surround ourselves with, just like we should be mindful of where we focus our mental energy and the thoughts we entertain. Our thoughts plant the seeds for our realities, influencing our perceptions, beliefs, and the direction of our lives. When we consume negative, toxic, or disempowering narratives without discrimination, we plant seeds of self-doubt, anxiety, and limitation in our minds. These seeds grow into self-defeating patterns, harmful habits, and a constant feeling of discontent and lack of fulfillment. On the other hand, by focusing on positive and empowering thoughts, we create a supportive environment for confidence, resilience, and personal development. By focusing on ideas, perspectives, and narratives that resonate with our values and authentic selves, we can create an internal environment that supports self-actualization, happiness, and reaching our full potential. Protecting our focus demands a strong dedication to being aware of ourselves and practicing mindfulness. It requires us to pay attention to our thoughts, identify negative patterns, and shift our focus to more positive and beneficial mental pathways. Practicing mindful attention involves setting boundaries and being able to refuse external distractions and negative influences that can harm our mental health. This involves managing our social media feeds, reducing exposure to negative environments, and surrounding ourselves with people and information that motivate and uplift us. In addition, choosing carefully where we focus our thoughts goes beyond external factors and includes our internal conversations and self-reflection. By recognizing the stories we tell ourselves, we can work on changing negative thoughts and developing a kinder inner dialogue. Understanding wisdom goes beyond just gathering information or being smart. It involves grasping the core principles that shape our lives, connections, and role in the world. It comes from combining experience, self-awareness, and a dedication to always learning and evolving. Embarking on the journey to wisdom involves first understanding and controlling oneself. By exploring our inner selves and practicing self-control, we can uncover important revelations about our desires, anxieties, and the influences that have molded our thoughts and actions. Developing self-awareness and emotional intelligence allows us to observe our thoughts and emotions objectively. This helps us respond to challenges calmly and gracefully instead of reacting impulsively. As we progress through the path of self-mastery, we will face challenges, obstacles, and tests that push our determination. Yet it is from these experiences that we acquire deep wisdom, discovering the lessons within each challenge and uncovering insights that can help us grow personally. As you gain more wisdom, the room for pain and unexpected events decreases. We get better at identifying the patterns and dynamics that control our lives, which helps us foresee potential challenges and deal with them purposefully. Dealing with unexpected situations becomes easier as we improve our ability to adjust and react calmly to changes. Furthermore, wisdom helps us accept and surrender, acknowledging that some parts of life are out of our control. Finding inner peace involves embracing the present moment wholeheartedly. Instead of fighting against the natural ups and downs of life, we can learn to go with the flow, trusting in our ability to handle challenges with wisdom and clarity. As we grow wiser, we also develop a strong sense of empathy and insight into the human experience. We understand that pain and unexpected challenges are common to all, and by showing compassion and embracing our shared humanity, we can provide support and guidance to those on their paths of growth and self-discovery. Lesson 15. Being a Mindful Observer The mind is constantly filled with thoughts, judgments, and mental narratives, which can keep us trapped in limiting beliefs, self-doubt, and the need for external validation. When we only focus on our thoughts, we lose touch with who we really are 
stuck in a pattern of overthinking and holding ourselves back from progress and personal development. Emotions, an important part of being human, can cause chaos and impulsiveness if not managed. Strong emotions like anger, fear, and jealousy can take over our decision-making, making it hard to think clearly and causing us to make choices that don't align with our core values and goals. Becoming a master of oneself requires developing the skill to observe mental and emotional patterns with detachment and without judgment. It involves being a mindful observer, watching thoughts and feelings come and go without getting caught up in their stories or overwhelmed by their strength. We are encouraged to approach each new experience with curiosity and compassion, acknowledging their temporary and ever-changing nature. By practicing mindful observation, we can cultivate a sense of spaciousness within ourselves. This allows us to approach life's challenges with clarity and intention. Instead of acting on immediate thoughts or emotions, we practice taking a moment to pause, breathe, and make decisions that reflect our core values and goals. Mastering oneself requires embracing self-acceptance and self-compassion. We understand that the mind and emotions are not adversaries to be defeated or silenced, but rather essential parts of our humanity that should be welcomed and explored with compassion and interest. By developing a mindset that is free from judgment towards our inner experiences, we can create a space of self-acceptance that supports personal growth and self-actualization. Final lesson. Personal mastery. Embarking on the path of personal mastery requires lifelong commitment, self-awareness, and a readiness to constantly develop and progress. It is a process that allows you to take control of your life based on your core values, unlock your full potential, and live authentically and purposefully. As you finish reading this book, keep in mind that the teachings are not just abstract ideas, but practical tools to incorporate into your daily life. Embrace the advice given here and be brave enough to start the journey of self-discovery, self-discipline, and radical self-acceptance. The journey ahead will surely bring difficulties and hurdles that will challenge your strength and determination. During challenging times, personal mastery reveals itself, helping you navigate life's complexities with grace, clarity, and a strong connection to your inner truth. Enjoy and acknowledge every milestone you achieve as it reflects your commitment to taking control of your future. Enjoy the personal growth, insights, and moments of self-realization that come from facing your fears, limitations, and self-imposed boundaries. Keep in mind that becoming a master is an ongoing journey of self-discovery, self-growth, and self-transformation. Embrace this lifelong adventure with an open heart and an inquisitive mind. Through this journey, you will discover the immense power within you to shape your reality, forge your own path, and leave a mark on the world. As you move forward from these pages, remember that you have the power to shape your life, find joy, and control your future. Absorb the lessons and allow them to lead you to a life filled with deep satisfaction, peace, and endless opportunities. You have an exciting journey ahead towards personal mastery. Fully embrace it and allow it to shape you into the exceptional person you were destined to be.